Is it better to do engineering, computer science, or mathematics? Well, there is no correct answer in general, obviously. Otherwise, why would the other courses exist? It all depends on what you want to do later and what you are good at. Computer science is a very broad spectrum topic that goes from building chips and electronic circuits at one end, which borders with electronic engineering, to proving theorems about the properties of computer programs at the other end, which borders with mathematics. And in between, you have all the layers, in fact, I should put them this way around, uh, of a pretty deep stack from compilers, programming languages, operating systems, networking protocols, algorithms, applications, security, user interface, artificial intelligence, logic, computational complexity, theory of computation, and so on and so forth. And so for someone who is interested in building stuff and in the lower layers of this stack, then the topic of computing could also be approached from the engineering side. Whereas for the more abstract layers at the top and for people interested in proving stuff rather than building stuff, it might instead also be approached from the mathematical side. I personally always had a penchant for building things, so my first degree was a master in engineering. Then I worked as a research scientist in an industrial research lab for a few years. Then I went back to university as a mature student and I earned a PhD in computer science. Then I became a lecturer in the engineering department. And then I moved back to the Department of the Science and Technology of Computers, where I am now a full professor. So you can take me as living proof that these subjects are related and interconnected. So the answer is that you should look at the intersection of what you like, what you're good at, and what best prepares you for the career you want for yourself once you get out of university. Bear in mind that these preferences of yours might also change throughout your life. So you don't have to fear that you are irrevocably committing to one thing forever. Your preferences might change and the world will change. What really matters is that besides a solid technical foundation, some of which will become obsolete anyway during your professional life and don't worry about that, you must acquire the ability to learn new things. And then if you do that, you will be prepared for anything and you will be a valuable person to have around whatever your professional context.